same way mo no April bosume ne da ne to so ngo twa fi mu auditor say free bank of Ghana eba public account committee ya yebusa wo no mo sika 11.9 million dollars a won de ma contractor say won fa nwe po alugu irrigation project no na no mo no na rongo central na share bedwani say wo hian chire chire mu ye pa wo sansem ne mu fi say said wo mo kan o po alugu multipurpose dam ne ade wo hunu hwe wo ho e bia na kwesi be foforo into one month money year, and also some of the two draw any. Page twenty-three. Uh, somewhere you will see final payment for construction of the Kwalago irrigation project. Yes, Kwalago irrigation project final payment. Final payment for the construction of the Kwalago irrigation project. The question is, I. I thought probably before payments are made, contractors present certificates. Because when you get to Kualago, there's nothing there. There's no even a pool. There's no even a signboard. And if the contractor is taking $11 million, there's nothing. There is, there is, there is no even a, 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 what do we call it, a, like a container. You can't even see the project site. So what certificate was presented before this money was paid? That's my question. I want to know why, how that money was paid. Pay. Yes, he will, he will answer. <laughs> if the amount you are referring to was paid in 2021, uh, not 2022, and the auditors would have to tell us because they must have cited their documentations uh, before they wrote this report. The auditor general, yeah, so maybe they, they can explain. Um, auditors, could you help us out over here? He's, then, um, it says final payment. Now, the Honorable Member is saying that there's nothing at that site. I'm sure when you did the audit, you saw something. Honorable Chair, controller instructed them to pay, and they paid. We are not aware whether the project uh, has been completed or there's nothing ongoing. Yes, sir. Uh, Chairman, um, I'm not happy with the response from the auditors because as part of the audit, they simply don't verify payment regularities. They do in-situ inspection of projects. So, yes, you may be at the headquarters, but the regional officers who who are closer to the project could have gone to site to ascertain that not merely paying for the project on paper, but the project has actually been delivered. So that's, that's my first follow-up. My second one is the Pualugu irrigation project is different from the Pualugu multi-purpose dam. So I want to find out that this payment is not in respect of the dam, but it's actually the irrigation which says farmers. Who oh, is, is the auditors? They, they saw the document. Uh, uh, because the, the, the governor actually clarified that it's the auditors. I think the auditors are supposed to. Yes, so they should be speaking to the document, the nature of the document that they saw. Otherwise, then chairman, I, I seek I seek your leave to demand that the documents based upon which these payments were was made should be furnished we should be furnished a copy of the set of documents for, I see. for purposes of um, uh, further interrogation of this matter I think the auditors could uh, review it and then uh, give us an update on what uh, which one it is. And since it says final payment, uh, they could uh, give the information back to